Welcome to the Advisory Science Channel. What happens when we mix materials? Look up at the air we breathe or down at the soil under your feet. What do they have in common? It may surprise you to know they are both mixtures. Mixtures are made when we combine two or more different materials together. Air is a mixture of gases like oxygen, carbon dioxide and water vapour. Soil is a mix of sand, silt, clay and even living and dead plants and animals. What happens when we add sugar to water? The sugar melts and disappears, right? Well, no. The sugar breaks up into tiny pieces surrounded by the water. Although we can't see it, we know the sugar is there because the water tastes sweet. We use special words to describe a mixture where something dissolves. The solid is called the solute. The liquid is called the solvent. And the resulting mixture is the solution. For example, in a mixture of sugar and water, sugar is the solute, water is the solvent, and the sugary water is the solution. Sometimes we want to dissolve solutes faster. There are three main ways to do this. Firstly, we can crush the solid solute. Secondly, we can heat the liquid solvent. Or thirdly, we can stir the solution, just like making a perfect cup of tea. When we think of a solvent, we often think of water. However, there are other solvents too. Acetone, some acids, fats and oils are a few of the other solvents available. So the next time you make a cup of tea or breathe in the fresh air, remember the wonderful science behind it. Thanks for watching. For more science resources, visit our website, advisoryscience.com and check out the blog for even more educational content. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest episodes.